Hello everyone, this is New Energy Group and this is our newest 6th uh, generation cryolipolysis machine, the ETG uh, 5026S. And uh, first we can see it with uh, total <coughs> uh, 4 work handles uh, on the machine now. Mm -hmm. uh, in fact, it was total 5 and the 4 can work at the same time. We can see first the machine with a very beautiful appearance. We can turn it to see. Okay, that's the four handles connected to machine uh, parts channel one, channel two, channel three, and channel four. It's with four filters. And uh, okay, let's get it to the front and uh, turn on the machine. Let's. Okay, this is the interface to type the password. The password is 60. Okay, here we can see the main page. Uh, first is the basic setting. We can see there are th three languages the French, and the, the English, and the Spanish. Okay, and uh, for the advanced setting, also the liquid setting. When we first use the machine, we need uh, to do the uh, liquid cycling once. Okay, this is for clean the filters. After we do the treatment, we need to uh, clean the filters. And this is self-testing. When we have problem with the machine and uh, we don't know What's the exact problem? We can do the uh, testing, self-testing. We will know what's the exact problem is. You can send us the results and we will have our engineer to analyze for you. Okay. Now we enter to the operation interface. There are four channels, channel one, channel two, channel three, and channel four. Uh, <coughs> for the settings, uh, the reheat function, there are M1 and uh, M0 to uh, reheat, uh, to treatment heat uh, modes and uh, the reheat time from 0, 0 means closed, to 5 minutes and the temperature is from uh, 37 to 50 And this is the treatment cooling temperature. When we use a very low temperature, uh, we need to make the work time to be shorter. And when we use uh, the hair temperature, we need to use longer treatment time to get a good treatment result. Mm -hmm. Okay, uh, after I introduced this, we need to <coughs> press here to get it ready for work. Like this is for channel one. We we'll press the button. The button on the handle. Press it once. Get it to start work. When we do treatment, uh, after it gets start work and reach the, the aimed intensity, we we'll press the button the second time. It will get into stable work. These are the two uh, cooling pipes. Mm -hmm. We can see it's bigger than the other normal ones. Mm -hmm. As we mentioned, it's with a total four work handles and the four work handles can work at the same time. After the first uh, uh, handle get into stable work, we can turn to other handles uh, and the order needed to be from channel 1 to, to channel 4 mm -hmm. after channel 1 get it uh, into stable work we turn to the channel 2 also click here to get ready and this is the channel 2 the same we click once to start work and like after we to reach the intensity we press it the second time it gets uh, into stable work 
Okay. And uh, we turn. Okay, sorry. I think we need to first, uh, after one get into stable work, we need to block it. Also, block the channel two. Also, uh, get into channel three. First, get it ready. And press here. This, this handle is special designed for double chain. You can see. Yes. And uh, we can also use it for the small parts, like for the arm. <clears throat> okay, we press here to get it to start to work. Okay, press the second time, get into stable work. Okay, and we lock it. Then get into the channel 4. First, get ready and press the button. Start to work. Press the second time. Get into stable work. Also, we lock it.